I can't believe tomorrow is October. It, it would help it if it actually felt, felt like it, yeah. like October, and certainly mm -hmm. has not. We beat a record high by four degrees yesterday. Really? I mean, it was, it was out of control, yeah. Doesn't surprise me, though. I mean, but this is crazy, Brian. We're not quite done with 90s yet. We've got a couple of days this week. Today, we get a break, okay. so that would be nice. Got an east-northeast wind. Uh, we're behind the front. It will dry things out a little bit, but we'll still have a little bit of rain around. Yeah. So I know we're all needing the rain, especially when it got to 98 degrees in Burlington yesterday. Oh, my goodness. 96 in Danville. 93 from my own area through Winston-Salem and all the way down to Lexington, as well as Ashboro yesterday. So, yeah, high heat yesterday. Uh, maybe not felt too much like that just because humidity isn't at those awful summer levels, but it is running high for the season. The average high of 76 degrees is way in the rearview mirror at this point. The old record, incidentally, was set back in 1921. 98 years ago, that record stood before it fell yesterday. Uh, temperatures are currently in the lower 70s. We have some mid 60s out west. A very warm start to the day for sure. But we do have a north northeast wind at place, and that will likely bring temperatures down maybe a, a couple more degrees before we start heating things up again. Had some decent rain come through at times this weekend, but it was spotty, so not everyone got it. Came through. Friday night into early Saturday uh, for much of the southeast Piedmont. Uh, we got a bit of a break, but it did affect uh, some areas yesterday. Then another round came through uh, late last night. Today, just kind of a 20% or an isolated uh, shower chance beginning around mid morning, continuing through this evening. Temperatures are down, still warmer than average, but down from yesterday significantly by about uh, 10, 12, 14 degrees this afternoon. East winds uh, start to develop at about 5 to 10. And again, just a 20% coverage as far as as rain goes later today. It'll be a little bit better farther west. High temperatures closer to 80 in the foothills. East winds at 5. Uh, best chances will be in the afternoon through the early part of the evening. Mountains of a 40% late day rain chance are also battling some early morning fog. Uh, visibility down to a mile near Boone. Most areas though are faring pretty well with that this morning. High of around 75 degrees a bit later in the afternoon. Looking ahead into this first week of October, it is looking dry and looking warm at least for the early part of this week. However, we are expecting some of this cool air to move in behind a front on Thursday night and Friday that will start to bring our temperatures down more uh, considerably. As far as rain goes today, again, it favors our western counties mostly for the latter part of the day with a few showers, including a few embedded thunderstorms. Eastern areas has that low end rain chance today. Models are trying to keep a rain chance around for tomorrow, too. We'll see how that plays out, but then temperatures will start warming up tomorrow and then peaking this week for Wednesday and Thursday. And I'd hate to say that we're done with 90s, but we aren't just yet. Heading into Wednesday, Thursday, sunshine with highs in the lower 90s. But look at the weekend. Highs, low to mid 70s. Morning lows in the low to mid 50s. Should feel pretty awesome around uh, Saturday and Sunday.